I think the number one thing most people want to know is when can I get my money back? So what's the expectation there? When can Americans expect their refund? So the expectation is that if you file your taxes and there are no issues with it, within 21 days, you should be able to get your refund if you're doing direct deposit. So the IRS has been working through this for months and we've been able to meet those expectations. The IRS has chronically low resources. Budget cuts have been blamed for delays in tax refunds and helping the wealthy avoid paying their fair share. So one of the challenges the IRS had, like any other institution, was that during the beginning of the pandemic, they had to shut down. And shutting down meant that over time, they built up a backlog of paper that they needed to deal with. And unlike lots of businesses and places in the country where we've invested in personnel, the IRS currently has as many people working there as they had in 1970. So it's taken them a long time to get through the backlog of paper they've had. The reality for us is that the IRS is critical to our government. It's the way that we take in the money to pay for things like roads, to pay for schools, to pay for our military. But Congress over the last decade has cut the budget, especially in areas in the IRS that allow us to enforce taxes against the wealthiest Americans. The reality is that most people like you and me will file our taxes on Monday and we get W-2s from our employers. But for wealthy Americans who don't get those W-2s that allow us to validate their incomes, it's really hard to audit their taxes. And Congress has cut the ability of the IRS to invest in things like that over time. What the IRS would like to do is to be able to go after the people who are most likely to try and avoid their taxes. And those are people who make the most money because most of their money doesn't come in the form of W-2s, but they come in things like stocks they own or other assets that are hard to value. But the challenge is, of course, um, auditing those people's taxes is hardest because they have lots of wealthy lawyers that they can put against it. And the IRS has few resources to do that. And so the money that we've gotten in the budget is going to go towards immediately making sure that we can clear the backlog. So making sure that the backlog of correspondence the IRS has gotten since the pandemic is cleared, but also we'll make investments in enforcement and some in IT modernization. The immediate priorities for us is making sure that we have more people to answer the phones so that when you call, people will be able to give you the information you need to make some of the modest changes to our IT that will make it easier for taxpayers to be able to file. And then finally, making sure that we have the enforcement dollars we need to go after those people who are least likely to pay their taxes. But it'll take time, but there are lots of immediate changes we can make now to improve services for taxpayers so that next tax filing season is easier than this one.